Hey guys, Michelle here with another unboxing, and today it is the World of Wizardry Geeker box, but this is the special edition box that was released late last year, and this um, it was released for sale late last year, and it came today, actually. It actually came before I went to work, but I saved it till I got home from work. However, I did kind of give a friend of mine a sneak peek. Um, because I was video chatting with a friend before work, and I saw let her see what was inside, but I have not seen it, so I'm excited. But so let's go ahead and open it. It's heavy, so unlike the normal geek gear boxes, this is plain white and it has a, it like has a flap that lifts up. So let's go ahead and open her up. Yeah. And pull the tissue paper back. And Alright, let's see what... Ooh! Oh, wow. Ooh, lots of good stuff already. Okay, let's see. Um, Looks like there's a shirt and a sweater in here. Ooh! Okay, let's go ahead and pull up this mug first. Ooh, it is a ceramic cauldron mug with the Hogwarts logo on it in gold. That's really nice. I really like that. That's how it looks. I'm really excited. That is really, really cool. Okay. And then the special edition exclusive pin is the sorting hat. That is really cool. All right. Let's go for this piece here in bubble wrap. And it's, I can see on here, it says something about exclusive and fall con, Funko Fall Convention. Ooh, I see what it is. It is Luna with her lion head hat. That is awesome. I have the regular Funko one. This is the rock candy one. That is awesome. Now I have the matching set. Very, very cool. I like that a lot. I really like that. And that is... Luna with her lion head hat is one of my favorite looks for some reason. I don't know why. What is this? Alright. And then... Let's go with this. Ooh, there's a poster in here. Let's go with this shirt. Oh, that is awesome. It's a Luna Love Good shirt. And it says, blame it on the Nargles. And it has her Spectre Specs. That is really cool. I like that a lot. Okay, I'm gonna, I want to save the sweatshirt for last. Because I like the way it looks already. This poster. Let's see if I can get it out without too much trouble. Okay, let's see what this is. Oh, that's cool. It is a Quidditch World Cup poster. On the top it says the 422nd Quidditch World Cup. And then it's got all the different countries. Along with the International Association of Quidditch. Around the center of it. And on the, it says the greatest magical event of the year. It says I, IQA International Quidditch Association MM. Ministry of Magic, Foreign Affairs, and Sports Department, and Federation International de Quidditch Association. That is really, really cool. I like that. That is that is very unique because we really haven't gotten. I mean, we've in the times that I've been getting this box, we have gotten some Quidditch related things, but not a lot. So that's kind of really cool. I really like that, and it's different than some of the other posters because it's it's um long versus wide. So that's really cool too. All right, and then the print down here. At the, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! This is heavy. Oh, dude, this is heavy. Oh, the 
That is cool. It it's the scene from the first movie where they're going on the boats to the castle and it's a metal print. Because back here it says metal prints and it's got a hologram tag and you can easily hang it with a mat with a magnet. That is really cool. That's something different. I'm gonna have to find a place to put this. Because that's pretty freaking sweet. No wonder why it was so, like, heavy feeling. Okay. Last thing. Is this... Oh. Oh, wow. It is definitely something for the Snape lovers. I'll tell you that much because of what I just saw in the back. So it's a black hoodie, and it's got, of course, the dough on the front, the Patronus of the dough on the front, and on the back, it's got Snape and says always. That is really cool. I really like that. And it's really soft feeling. I like that a lot. And it's a large, because that's what I always get in my uh, shirts. So it's a men's large. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, wow. This is cool. As I'm looking through this, it is, the sweater is a glow in the dark. Because it says it right here. It glows in the dark. That's two times now that we've gotten, well, since I've been getting this, that I've gotten glow in the dark items. That is really cool. I like that a lot. So we have the sorting hat pin, the display metal print, and it says, This month, in place of a normal print, we have given you a World of Wizardry-inspired display, which are all hand-signed by the Master of Production. That's really cool. And then we got the Rock Candy Luna Lovegood New York Comic Con exclusive. The Quidditch World Cup, the mug... The shirt and of course the sweater. That is really cool. I'm really excited. And what's really awesome too is supposedly I thought when I read the email about this that it wasn't supposed to be released or it wasn't supposed to ship till today. So I was not expecting it to arrive today. I was expecting to see it like next week or like shortly after the first of March. Like my uh, normal box would probably be here. But it came today, which is amazing. And I am absolutely in love with all of this stuff. The hoodie is amazing, and so is that shirt. I might take that shirt and wear it to Universal Hollywood when I go this summer if it's not super hot. I don't know. I think it would be cool to wear that, though, because that would totally be... It would totally work for Harry Potter to wear a Blame It on the Nargal shirt. Or... Any, really, any Harry Potter shirt I have. But depending on the temperature, of course. But yeah, definitely. I definitely like that. I really like all the stuff that's in this box. And I really like all of the stuff that Geek Gear's been doing lately in general. Like, I am really happy with this sub box. And I'm really glad that I've been getting it. Um, I, I don't know if I'm kicking myself or not for not getting the most recently released special edition sub box. Um, I don't know. It was, I don't know why. I just didn't, I didn't jump for it this time, but maybe I will regret it. I don't know. I mean, I've been loving everything I've gotten in every of the special edition boxes, but I've been trying to be good and not spend money. So that's why I didn't order it. But I don't know. I might I'm half tempted to see if I can still order it tonight. Because I kind of want it. Because I know there's a Dobby exclusive shirt, which was cool. Because we saw that online. which It looks really cool, though. I don't know. We'll see. But I will be back with you guys another time with another unboxing, which will likely be the next uh, regular, regularly scheduled World of, Wizardry, World of Wizardry box, which is February's, which should be here soon. Yeah. All right. I'll see you guys later. Bye.